tough. Oh shit, maybe not. Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing today? A lot of you are on this channel because of the robot vacuums I've reviewed for years. Sorry there hasn't been a ton of content on that, but there really is not much new technology coming out in that field, so I have to do some other videos. And one of those things that I've really gotten into lately is 3D printing and laser cutting. So there's gonna be a lot of stuff coming on that, but I will still keep doing vacuum related stuff as long as they keep making it new and fun. There is a brand new Ecovacs that I'm working on right now called the T20 Omni. Uh, that's an all-in-one, washes the mopping pads and does all that, just like the, all the latest and greatest. Um, so I got that right over there. I'm going to be reviewing that in the next few days, so there will be a new video on that. I do have a couple other products, one from Roborock, one from Dream Tech, I believe. And then, just to kind of give you some vacuum content, I ordered, well, there's seven here. It's seven of the cheapest robots I could find from Wish.com. And I'm sure they're going to be garbage, but I thought it'd be kind of a fun video. And then let me know in the comments what you want me to do with all these different robots. I still have to work on my huge rice challenge. I know a lot of you want to see that still on this channel. Um, I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to do it. Maybe I'll use all these cheap robots in this video and my next video. I actually ordered, it's either seven or eight robot vacuums from Amazon that are cheapest on the website. So it's going to be a lot of crappy robots, but we'll see what you get for... I think it was anywhere from $10 all the way up to $30 or $40. So some of them are going to be real trash. <laughs> some, as you can see, are much smaller than you think they'd be. Uh, maybe a couple of them are going to be good. Who knows? We'll test them out and see. But in this video, these are all from Wish.com. I ordered these a good eight months ago. I just never got around to it. And I think I finally need to make a video on this and move on. <laughs> so once again, let me know down below what you want to see with these robots and the next video's robots. So there'll be about 15 new robots on this channel, all very cheap, budget-friendly, uh, probably honestly the worst on the market, but I thought it'd be a cool video. So do me a favor, guys, like this video and subscribe. Should be kind of a cool video, and what I do with these robots should make some good content too. So let me know in the comments what you want to see. So first off, let's go ahead and do the opened ones, because I did open a couple. These here are still sealed. I honestly don't even have a clue what robots they are. This one has three of them in there, it feels like, and then one each on those packages. So robot vacuums, as you know, they're probably about that big round, and the, the pictures you see on Wish or Amazon or any places like that look like a normal size robot. But as you can see, here's two different ones that are not even half the size of a traditional robot vacuum. They even try to trick you and put a little round thing on top to make it look like it has LiDAR. And obviously something this cheap is never gonna have LiDAR. So these manufacturers, and, and they know they're making these junk robots and tricking people into buying them. Even at, I think, I, don't, I really don't remember what I paid for these. I know it's from $10 to maybe 30. Say this one was 30, for instance. Nobody in the right mind is gonna be happy giving this for 30 bucks. So. We're gonna go ahead and open all these up real quick on camera, and then we will do some testing on it in a later video. So let's go ahead and do these two first, get these out of the way. So this is, <laughs> there's not even a brand name. It's just called Automatic Sweeping Robot number 8088. You know this is gonna be quality if they don't even have a name brand on it. Um, I don't know if these are gonna be charged. If they are, I'll throw them on this table and run them for a second and uh, see if they do anything. All right, let's start with number 8088 and see what you get from wish.com. Let me know in the comments for each one of these guys if you order this for even say $20 and you got any of these, would you be happy? So this one looks like it should be white. <laughs> Here is the power cord. It's literally a little USB with a, like a headphone jack almost. And here is your, oh my God. Here is your robot vacuum. Notice how they put, uh, it, this might be, no it's not. 
So they can't even, so on this box it shows, I guess the black one comes with gold. So this one has like what it looks like a chrome or stainless steel top to make it look fancy. And they can't even put the sticker on there to make this go. So let's see if this has any power. Obviously, <laughs> this is a total gimmick. It has dual side brushes though. You guys know it's going to clean well. Um, so these should spin. It's got a tiny suction port. It's not even rubber. It's made out of hard plastic. So this thing might even kind of mess up your floors if it hits it right. And then it's got one of those little toy spinning things that makes it go randomly throughout your house. Let's see if it has any power. Probably not. Let's see. All right, go clean my house. I got a power button even work. Oh, it does. Look at that. Hey, what, does it have a drop sensor? <laughs> it does not have a drop sensor. So this is the technology you're going to get. Absolutely useless. It's going to pretty much do nothing. You might as well give it to your kid as a... What the heck? You might as well give it to your kid as a toy. Oh, look, it actually has a little flap for the dust. So what's funny is... So all your dust is going to collect in here, right? But it's just going to fall right back out the hole. Where the heck does the dust go? Wow, guys, this thing's a home run. So this is why you don't order something from Wish. And we'll, we'll do some crazy tests with these if you guys want. We could put do the rice challenge on these and see if they pick up anything at all. I can't imagine. I don't even think there's a suction motor in this, is there? Yeah, there's a little motor there, so it might actually suck worse than it actually you know sucks all right let's move on to the next one this is going to be very interesting i'll fully charge these so we can get the best the best test possible i can't imagine these running for more than a couple of minutes each all right now we're stepping up to the big boy <laughs> a little bit bigger box probably a little bit bigger robot but this one actually has a brand name Jin Boy, Smart Sweeper, Multifunction, um, Low Noise, of course, because there's no freaking suction. Has a UV lamp built in, so it's going to kill germs as it runs it over. And it says Strong Suction with obs Obstacle Avoidance. Yeah. We'll see if it uh, avoids falling off the table. This one, I think, is white as well. Instructions, any of that crap. They at least put it in bubble wrap, so they're trying to protect their amazing investment. Another USB cable. This one's a micro. That's even worse. Um, and then an amazing cleaning brush that you probably won't even need because there's nothing in it to clean because it won't suck up anything. So, oh my god. This thing doesn't even have side brushes. So this one does have a little rubber flap here. So it's actually going to clean better than that one because any debris that it runs over is going to hit this flap and get stuck. And then the amazing suction power is going to suck up all your debris. This one actually has a rechargeable battery right here and they have a tab like a toy. So we're going to pull that out and uh, see what this guy has to offer. So no side brushes. This one does have side brushes, but this one has the rubber thing that I think would overall clean better. What do you guys think? So we've got that pulled. Let's see the. Oh, this one actually has a little. No, it doesn't. So it's this, it's basically the same exact robot, just different size. Because that's the no. This okay. If you guys want to know more, if you guys want to know more info on these, let me know down in the comments. But this one at least has a box with a lip down here. So the debris will actually stay in here. So, and a bigger filter. So we're stepping up here, guys. This is going really quite well. I'm glad I bought these. <laughs> the lid fits really good too. All right, let's see if this guy does anything. Um, it says obstacle avoidance. Then here's your little lights at the bottom that are supposed to kill germs. Yeah, right, that's not gonna do diddly squat. So, let's see, here we go. Fire this baby up. It just ran over some stuff and... It didn't fall. <laughs> I 
Let's give it a little pile of dirt. Really. Run over the dirt. Guess this thinks I'm trash. Eh, sucked up a little bit of it. So look at that UV light. You're, don't worry about germs, guys, if you guys buy this. So I don't know. I don't know which one do you think is better. This one has side brushes. This one has UV light. This one's obviously better. I don't even remember if these side brushes spun, did they? Oh, they do, okay. All right, so that's two amazing robots. Let's keep this party going. High quality. Now these, I truly don't have a clue what I ordered. I'm sure it's similar. Hopefully there's some bigger ones because in the pictures, they truly look like full-size robots. But from the packaging, oh, this one's even smaller. Ooh, individually wrapped. All right, this is gonna be exciting, guys. I am so pumped. All right, so anyways, back to being pumped. Which one should we do? I heard you guys say the small one. So, let's rip into this bad boy. This is gonna be... Woo! Wait, is that the same exact thing? That's a... <laughs> so, this model is 8018, and this was 8088. And they have the little stainless steel topper on there that makes it look more fancy. This one got beat to hell. Uh, let's see how, how it is. This one had to have been one of the cheap, like $10 ones. So I can tell it's gonna be a POS. Ooh, it's yellow. It's another great cord. <laughs> These are freaking toys, guys. Oh my God, are you kidding me? That's got to be a joke. So this has sucking and sweeping technology. So you can use this almost as a mop, guys. This is good. Here is, <laughs> here is your mopping pad. No joke. This is your mopping pad. And they include some Velcro to make this thing mop. And it's the same high-end technology. It's basically the same exact robot. Um, yeah, same robot, but this one has a high-end mop, and, uh, I mean, it's bright yellow. What more do you want? So let's install this mopping technology. Man, I wish. I wish I didn't order these. So you put this back here. Ooh, this is going to clean really good. <laughs> is, is this a joke? So here's your mopping pad, you know, all, very high-end technology. All I gotta do is stick it, stick it and forget it. So that's gonna mop your floors for you, two inches at a time. And uh, let's see if this guy offers any type of drop protection. Or do anything. Work! I'm gonna feel it's suction power, it's intense. Dude, this thing doesn't even work. Ugh. Maybe if I throw it. Here's the fan. That's your suction motor there. Let's see what we can do to make this. See if we can make this thing work any better. It's tough. Oh shit, maybe not. All right, this is, uh, let's inspect this a little bit more. Make sure, um, this one's obviously, turn off. Try to break it. 
Ugh. So this is the high-end tech you get from Wish. Okay. Oh, sorry. Oh, I broke it. Here's the high. Here's the high-end technology. You get a battery. That looks like a nine volt that they maybe put a little box around. Some rubber um, belts. Oh, that belt broke. So you know. High-end technology. Let's see if uh, I can turn this bad boy back on. Yeah, this thing's done. <laughs> no, why? Why? Oh, I was gonna mop my floors. I guess I can't mop them tonight. Next. So, obviously, I wish this thing worked. Oh, that was so fun. All right, on to the next. Should I keep this, you think, for another? Maybe I can mop my floors manually? I don't know. Next, let's do this one. We'll just keep going with this. Let's see. This one. They're all the same. <laughs> I swear, when I ordered these, I did not order all the same exact ones. This one is... Oh. Number 8088, so it's the same exact thing as this. Oh, I know for sure I didn't order two of the same thing. Ooh, this one's pink though. Now we're set. Sweet. All right. Let's see if this one works. Come on. Maybe the battery's just dead. Oh, what a piece of shh. Beep. All right, so pink robot number four. Not doing a dang thing. Um, battery could just be dead. I'll charge it up and show this baby off in the next video where I review these amazing robots. We got three more. If there's any more of the same ones, I'll be <laughs> very surprised. Because it's wish.com, guys. People... They kind of just send whatever the heck they want to you. Um, I am. Ooh, we got a new one. We got a new one in very good, con very good high-end condition. We ha this one's a, a Roy and Steyer. This one's gonna be good. All in Chinese, so I have no clue what it says. Oh my God. This one is powered by double A's. Oh my god, oh my god. Woo! So this bad boy, oh, it's so dusty. Um, why, why am I doing this video? <laughs> why, why did I do this? Uh, for all of you guys, of course, so please like and subscribe, guys, if you enjoy. If you're this far in, go ahead and subscribe for me. I'd really appreciate it. Um, so, I, oh, this comes with, uh, a mask. I can go rob a bank. Huh. So this one comes with two mopping pads. Super high end. Um, I'll show you. Oh my god, you gotta peel and stick your own stuff. So four batteries. I'll plug this back in since they can't even give that to you together. So it's got some Velcro. Peel it off. Just gonna stick a couple because we know this thing ain't doing anything worth a dang. Okay, one more. All right. So you send this guy out. Say you dropped a little drip of water. This guy will handle that with no issue. So you stick it on, and then you send this guy out. There's not even a vacuum in this guy's. You send this out. And that bad boy is going to mop your floor. They're going to be so shiny after this thing cleans. And all there's the little power button. Um, I'll get some batteries and we'll test this in the review video, which is going to be so exciting. This one? Okay, so it's battery, so it doesn't even come with a charger. Yeah, it's so dusty. What a piece of... Next. Oh, this one's high end. We have a clean robot. 
smart, intelligent vacuum cleaner. Yeah. Smarter than me for buying this crap. Alright. So much dust in this. So this one comes professionally wrapped. I don't know why I'm putting some there and some there, but whatever. So this one, this one makes you work. I have to actually put on, at least it powers on. All right, so you gotta put on your own side brushes. Oh, man, making us work. Okay. This one also just has a hard plastic port. No uh, plat no rubber on the back to help suck it up. Uh, crappy charging cable, crappy brush. But this one, <laughs> this one's gonna mop your floor really well. This is like a nice high-end microfiber mopping pad that isn't gonna do jack. So, peel these off, stick them on the back. What am I doing with my life? I shouldn't be doing something else. Peeling this crappy sticker and putting this piece of junk together. There's YouTube video and stuff. So this, well, I mean, imagine how good this is gonna clean. Um, probably just spit on this a couple times, get it nice and wet, send this baby out, and uh, you got yourself a amazing cleaner. Same exact port on all these. Uh, they just change the shape of it a little bit. Let's see if this one has drop detection. I have faith. Hmm. That's probably the best one out of all of them, to be honest. I mean... You can tell it's high end. The drop sensor didn't work, unfortunately. That, that really made me sad. But, uh, I mean. Look at that. Power's right on. Alright, get back here. So, what do you guys think? Get nice and clean. Alright, last one, guys. I know if you're still here, comment below. These vacuums suck. That way I know you watch this whole video, please. And don't forget to like and subscribe because this is amazing content. This one is actually in a bubble mailer, which is the first, I think. Did I already do? I think this was the one that was broken and I broke. I don't know. Let's see. This one is the J23A. Let's see, it's smart. I bet you it's really smart. Ooh, it has a light. Powerful suction. Noise reduction system. And it sucks and sweeps. Let's see if this guy has a more of a, a two-inch pad to help you. Oh my god, it's got a three-incher. Alright. This one does not have bubble wrap on the inside. Shame. So it's by the same brand. I just knew these were gonna be good, so I ordered three of them. Sweeping robot, look how much bigger. This thing can eat them. All right. I kinda like the pool tab. <sighs> same technology. Hard plastic. Crappy side brushes. But this one has, oh man. We're stepping it up here, guys. This one has a one and a half by three to three and a half inch pad. The biggest out of all of them. It puts this one to shame. God, what are you thinking? Alright, let's stick this thing on here because it's I can't wait to mop my floors. That's gonna look awesome in here, guys. That's, uh, I'm just so impressed. All right, we got the Velcro on. Grab your high-end mopping 
apparatus thing. Turn this baby on. Will this one drop? What do you think? It won't. Full faith. 100 for no freaking way in the world. No! Nah! Strong suction. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed that video. It was, I'm just amazed by how good quality Wish.com stuff is. So if you ever thought about saving money on a robot vacuum, don't do it. These things are absolute trash. I don't care what happens to these. So if you guys want to see me blow these up, run them over with my truck, throw them against a wall, whatever, for some cool content. Let me know down in the comments what you'd like to see. First, I do want to see if they'll do anything in a rice challenge, because I need to do a, a not cool video like I have been for the past two years. Let me know in the comments real quick what you want to see in that video, which I need to make really, really soon. So if you enjoyed this one at all, once again, like and subscribe. And I have another one for you. I don't know if I should say sorry or not, but let me show you these bad boys. I got seven, six or more. I don't know if there's more in these boxes or not. I really don't. I have no clue what I ordered because it's been like eight months. But I have a lot more of these type of robots. But these are from Amazon. So I think it's going to be better robots than this absolute putrid garbage. So if you guys want to see this video, that's going to be coming up soon. And you're welcome. What am I going to do with this crap? Ugh. Thanks for watching.